Hello friends, welcome to our channel Electroceramics Lab. Today we will be discussing about determination of equivalent points for space groups, drawing equivalent point diagram and symmetry diagram of the corresponding space group. The main focus will be on P1 space group, P1 bar space group, P2 and P21 space group. P1 and P1 bar space groups belong to triclinic system and P2 and P21 belong to monoclinic system. P indicates its primitive and other systems are body centered, C centered, face centered, A centered, etc. and this one is primitive. In primitive, the total number of lattice points in the unit cell is 1. So, the lattice parameters are A not is equal to B not is equal to C and angles alpha not is equal to beta not is equal to gamma. First, we will discuss about P1 space group. P1 space group. In the space group, to determine equivalent point, we have to consider one point x, y, z and then we will apply the symmetry operation of this space group 1 and the resultant point we get x, y, z. Then the next attempt is drawing equivalent point diagram. In order to draw equivalent point diagram, we will consider axis is this one as A and this one as C. This, is, this will be positive direction and this one is the positive direction of C axis and this is the negative direction of the C axis and above the plane is the positive direction of B axis if we consider and then the position of X, Y, Z of this unit, this one is one unit cell position of X, Y, Z will be this one and then here because this one is another unit, here another unit cell will start this one is here positive sign indicates that the point is above the plane and z is plus if it's minus sign is minus then it will be below the plane and z will be minus and since the in p1 space group there is only one symmetry uh, there is no symmetry element present that's why the uh, symmetry diagram will be simply the simply the sign of one in unit cell and then next is the p1 bar space group in p1 bar space group again you have to follow the determination of point group for the space group like here symmetry is one bar and then if you consider x y z and if you apply the one bar symmetry then you will get x y x bar y bar and z bar this one is result 10 point after applying the symmetry element the symmetry diagram will be this one is for p1 and this one is p1 bar will be if we consider this one is a axis and along this is c axis and then this one is x y and z point and the x bar y bar z bar will be minus. minus sign indicates that here z is minus that means this point is below this plane and plus is this uh, this point is above the plane and other points will be like that and in this equivalent point diagram since there is inverse inversion center that's why I have to put comma on this point according to crystallographic diagram so this is the drawing equivalent point diagram and then in the last there is symmetry diagram of p1 bar space group the symmetry diagram <coughs> the already exists symmetry diagram 
at this point the here at this point if you consider there is inversion center because this inversions inversion after applying inversion uh, about this point then we generate another point which is on the opposite side that means x bar y bar z bar and due to that the inversion point will be on on this position that means here and the inversion center in sign of the inversion center will be like that and here these are the uh, general inversion centers and the the auto generated inversion centers are there if you consider here the inver the inversion of this object will be the this one and that's why here another inversion center generated automatically and here inversion center yeah. sorry here will be minus and like that here is similarly there is generation of another inversion center and the and in this point here also and here also and in the middle also because the inversion of this object is this one so this is the symmetry diagram of p1 bar space group and this one is equivalent point diagram now we will discuss about next two space groups p2 and p21 which is monoclinic A not is equal to B not is equal to C and alpha is equal to gamma is equal to 90 and beta not is equal to 90 first is P2 space group first we will determine the equivalent points for this space group symmetry element 2 we have to apply and you have to remember that actually space group presentation will be this one this is the x axis this one is along y axis and this one is along z axis so we have to apply the two full symmetry element if you consider this one is one point and then applying two fold symmetry element parallel to y this one is parallel to y and then resultant point we get x bar y z bar okay two points we get and then drawing equivalent point diagram considering this one is a axis this one is c axis and the perpendicular to this plane is b axis which is unique axis unique axis b then the x y position of x y z will be this one and then after applying to fold rotation along y axis the resultant point will be this one plus sign means above the plane and, and then next point will be this one this one and this one is one unit cell the other points are equivalent points are like this this one is equivalent point diagram and the symmetry element diagram of p2 is here i like to draw symmetry diagram of p2 will be in this point there is one two fold and the symbol of two fold is this one here also one two fold and this one is axis this point after applying two fold this point will come here that means there is also two fold which we have applied already symmetry the symmetry symbol of two fold is this one in this corner similarly there is this symmetry elements already exist and then there is generation of other symmetry elements at this point two fold because here if you consider one axis two fold axis then 
you can uh, imagine that here there will be one two fold here also one two fold here similarly one two fold at this point also one two fold and in the middle also two fold because after applying two fold this point will come here that means here in the middle also there is middle of the unit cell there is also one two fold axis this is the symmetry diagram of p2 space groove and next is p21 space group first similarly we will determine the equivalent points for this space group considering x y z a point and then 2 1 2 1 2 subscribe 1 that means this one is screw axis 2 1 screw axis parallel to y this one is equivalent to this space group is equivalent to 1 2 1 1 this one along z axis this one along y axis and this one along x axis and the unique axis is c sorry b so resultant point after applying to one screw will be x bar y plus half z bar to one screw after applying to one screw the resultant point comes like that two in uh, two x uh, axis will be minus and along one axis there will be translation half translation since it is parallel to y axis to one screw that's why the translation along y axis and the other two axis will be the inverse sign sign will be reverse opposite sign that means if there is plus sign and then the resultant sign will be minus so we'll go to equivalent point diagram of p21 space group this one is one unit cell and then this one is the xyz if you consider this position xyz and then the final after applying screw axis the position will be like that here the half plus means this this point is above the plane and then there is half translation from this plane that means this point is not similar to this point uh, the z value of this point and this point is not same there is uh, plus of more the z value with respect to this point and then other points will be like that half half plus similarly and half plus this one is equivalent point diagram and then next is symmetry diagram of p21 space group here one screw was there the symbol of two one screw is like that so at this point there will be symbol of two one screw axis at this point also there will be two one screw axis symbol of two one screw axis at this point also at this point also similarly and if you look carefully then there is generation of another screw axis at this point this point this point this point as well as this point so the other possible screw axis will be at this point and this one will be another screw axis this another screw axis screw axis that means this one is one axis along b this one is also another axis and this one is another axis this is the symmetry diagram of p1 symmetry diagram of p21 space group and okay this one is a and this one is b and the position of this screw axis is 0 0 0 if you consider and this one is positive and this one is also positive sorry this one is c axis unique axis is b and this one the coordinate of this screw will be half 
y and 0 see 0 y half and this one will be 0 y half if you like this video then please share to your friends and please subscribe this channel because we will put more videos